bit of a live stream update. I think the stream went down just sometime in the rain then. This is Lake Coringal. It's a whole lot of nothing. And it's all about two foot deep. So we're trying to head to the far end to maybe find some uh, less dirty water. It's been stirred up and that wind sort of died off again. This afternoon we only got one fish in the boat, about six or eight nice flatties, a few tail, a couple of toads. Flat in particular was a bit disappointing. Some of them felt like brim. Um, but anyway, we've got a few fish in here in practice. I didn't come in early because that changed. I was scared of it. <coughs> but now it's sort of nice. Hopefully there's not a big westerly follow of this rain. In which case it'll be not nice again. Anyway, enjoy Lake Corrie. Time we get up the top here, it should be alright. shallow. I can tell with my depth finder here. Four runners. Shallow dive. Also with the tip of steering up. What's the magazine you've started in the west? West Australia fishing on the first Not surprisingly. How far does it go up? Uh, whole state. Not over a lot. Alright, shallow chubby time. Or shallow atomic or shallow anything. Smart, I bought the silent one too. <laughs> you idiot. 
bought what? I bought the silent chubby. No, so I wouldn't mind a rally one. But I bought one the other day because that's the normal level of chubby stocks that I have. Okay. And there's a silent version of that. That'll be good. I'll be into that. Got a look at any of these? Nah, it's all good. I'll try this out. This is, it's only two foot deep. You can't get, you can't, they, you, they know when something's two foot from them. Shallow chubby. You can even throw a um, really lightly weighted plastic, maybe. Roll it up the bottom.
species. Just dragging the bottom on the motor, mate. That's all right. Are we? Yeah. <laughs> That's what we'll tell ourselves.
sneaky little bastards. Sunny's out there. Looks like it's going to find it for the way in. I hope so. It's nice. What's the biggest bag so far in the ABT brim? Uh, 7 something. Oh, wow. Heavy in the What's that one? It's a Dyer with Prezzo rolling crank. Just a little shallow dip thing. Especially with our net. Yeah, we'll make do. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I'll leave mine out. We lost that problem. We'll be pleased with that problem. Here you got a kegger on the uh, nearly the last cast at Lake Macquarie the other one. Oh, it was the last cast, yeah, was yeah. <laughs> I only had four too. Oh. It was 37 to 4 on the last throw. That's great. On the flat. Oh, good. Hey, right. the bite? Yep. Is that a plastic? Uh, no, just that little. Which is a crank. Absolutely smashed the Louis. You got a big one yesterday? We got a big one as well. But just uh, in three feet of water, he just boom! And off he went. How disappointing is that? Yeah. <laughs> they actually fight for. Oh, they hard. don't. They run a long way. Too. Yeah, I thought, that's I why thought, I thought it was a brim for sure. I thought Ludrick always just went off court and they always just shake their heads and. So when I worked the flats too, uh, um, on the pre-fish over at Ben, there was some big blue brick in there amongst the brim, right in on the timber. Something shallow and black.
Was that a slur? Yep. Right behind. Jesus. Impressive hook box. So when I look, I look after them, they're expensive, the little they're sharp. So. Yeah. What ones are you putting on? A uh, little decoy, the decoy wide gaps. Yeah. But I think you can't have them rattling around in the box because it's not So switch into this thing, this has got some, some rattles. Actually fishing this on braid, which is unusual, but I want to keep it shallow. We is in shallow water.
in Albany, there, no, there is. There's a lot of fish in Albany. Yeah. A lot of small ones, like, you know, just legal ones. Yeah. The black one, they still have a version leading from black through there. So okay. That's a great river with fish and snag, deep water and flats and everything, but it's just, when they aggregate, they get the same. Yeah. So we're going there next year. Every other year we do a two two event road trip, yep. and then every other year we do one close to Perth, and do the one event. So you're going we alternate, Al alternate that with Tassie. Yep. Albany and um, Augusta, Blackwood okay. River. Black Brim Fishery? Like Black Brim. Albany's cool, it's got like oyster acres and clean oh, water. Okay. And on those aquas, you can catch a fish every single cast all day. Yep. That might be a good road trip that one. Yeah, it's like it's not boat it's or it's not boat. Or
down again and we'll do the kind of balancing.
Or you just fish in the banks here? Just no, no, just fish in the open. Okay. Fishing with those, uh, that one there, the one with no nib. Yep. And it's suspended, the fluorocarbon drags them down under the water. Okay. There's a little creek in here though, it opens up into a over in the back, there's a log across the mouth of it. Just simply jump over the log and get in. Try to lift me over it, but I might get a space in the back, push this up, and then we'll go to the front and slide over it. Right. See how it's all muddy it up again now? See how the water's all muddy again? Yeah, it didn't take long, did it?
traveling now. We want to spook them. Sold the local, local.
speed. Water starting to come in. No, that's us stirring it up the way in.
food yourself? Yeah. Where's he at? Uh, we've got three donuts and two four out of five. Oh, okay. Which is pretty standard for now. I don't think this is Barrett's or more and Barrett's or more. Yeah. Not oh, one top ten. Well, Barra fishing though, sort of the same as we fishing on. Sitting one spot, you throw the right thing to win, or you can go shallow and yeah, catch throw, around around yeah. throw around big joint and swim made and get a really awesome bite. Yeah, you know, so. And get bricked down. There. I always go down and get right tonight. I'm not going to muck around with the swim bait. I'm just no top water, just going to go straight and stuff and work something. Like got some two short of people to yeah, yeah. And top water for Barra is fantastic. Oh. I, you know what? This year was the first top water fish I've seen in five years. I've never been to five years. Yeah. But it did come off one morning and I saw a few walking around and a big Zara spooked out. Yeah. Uh, I missed it. Two months later, I got mine and it jumped off. Had another couple of hits. That would have been the culmination of throwing that top water for 30 hours over the last five years. Like most lakes that have bony rivulets don't have hot water bottles. No, that's right.
you one thing I'll be back. I've had a wonderful experience. I love Tasmania. I love this one. This was great. Yeah. All day, Richie. I'm logging off because today is going to go and help with the weigh-in.